After the postponement of the launch of the e-Naira, Africa's first central bank digital currency, CBDC, Monday, 25th October 2021, was set for the official unveiling of the e-Naira by the president of Nigeria. But this is all for the news, purely ceremonial, for whom it may concern. What you should know is the release of the e-Naira application, the speed wallet. Digital currency is nothing without a wallet because it what lets you receive and send money. Basically, you make all payments through this app and it is available now for download through the Apple App Store or Google Play Store. Let me show you. It's quite straightforward. Go to your Play Store, search for Inera Speed Wallet, tap to download, wait a little bit for your internet to decide, allow your OS to do its thing. Once installed, tap to open and you are here. Here, most likely you are new. So down on the page, tap on sign up. Then tap on sign up with your bank. Takes you to the list of all the banks, including the central bank. In my case, this is my bank. So we go. Create new account. This is the form. Let's fill it. Enter phone number, password, confirm password. The password must be 12 characters or more. Make sure it matches. If it checks out, then continue. Feel free to pause this video and review the steps. Let's go on. Next is personal information. Enter your first name, last name, date of birth, state of origin, then bank account and bank verification number BVN, accept the terms and condition, then tap on continue. Be careful to enter all information right, date of birth, surname, account number, BVN. As you are entering the info, it's verifying your KYC information from the BVN database. So be guided. If like me, you try entering wrong info multiple times, it's going to lock you out and give you this error message. Please contact support too many attempts. This is really good for security against brute force attacks. After that, if everything checks out, a new account is created. For iOS, it's the same process but different interface. Continue to your new wallet, your own. All you have to do now is to get it funded. You can go to your banking application. There will certainly be an option for in error in the transfers section. Put in your ID, amount, and send some money to your wallet, fast and easy. Or get someone with already funded wallet to send you some. For payments, very soon after the pilot phase, you will be able to spend your in error at the market, buy suya or even cut some soap. <laughs> Onboarding is still going on. It is expected that new technology will always come with concerns. Concerns about security, privacy, whether to trust it or not. You just need to know that in era is just another network. Typical like your GSM networks, your MTN, Glow, or 9Mobile. But instead of a SIM card to identify you and enable you make calls, text, and browse the internet, you get a wallet. The Speed Wallet enables you to make payments, receive, and or send money. This is your account. Your identity is attached to it, which is why you entered your BVN in the first place. CBN is the owner of this network. The banks are like super members and you, through your e-wallet, are a member who is attached to the super members who are in turn attached to the network owner who issues the e nera in the first place to be used. Get it? Through this chain, all transactions, sending and receiving of e nera are facilitated between all members. Anyone can send or receive money to and from anyone. Also, on this network, Applications and services can be built for all members to access or a certain group of members as defined and permissioned. For example, your electricity distribution company can sell meter tokens to its customers on the Inera platform and you pay with Inera. Road safety can decide to build an application on the network to enable drivers register and renew driver's license and so on. You know, like passport, insurance, bills payment, and even e-commerce. You'll start seeing Inera option when checking out of Jumia, Conga, and the rest. There is a great deal of possibilities. However, it will come with its own issues. Every tech has its vulnerabilities. Like you and I, they will be identified, resolved, and we move. No going back. Like CBN said, Inera will exist alongside the current system of payments, cash, cards, and others. It will also be made available not only through Android or iOS applications, but also through POS, USSD, contactless payment, web, and other channels. It's literally same Naira, but more possibilities. Welcome to the edge of new money. 
Tell me what you think. Would you trust the Inera? Would you be among the first to give it a try? Down in the comments. It's your public tech advisor. Thank you for watching. Until the next one. <laughs> Cheers.